Are you ready to get inspired? Okay. Let's talk about the best nation in the world. Of course, the best nation in the world is imagination. Sorry, Canada, you come second. Oh, Canada. Jack, it's okay to come second. Jack is my little brother. I'm older than him by one minute. If only he had used his imagination, he would have been older and smarter than me. Too late. Imagination is really important because it lets you look back to the past and forward into the future. Without imagination, you're just normal, ordinary, and stuck where you are now. Boring. With imagination, you can be extraordinary. Albert Einstein said, "Imagination is more important than knowledge." What he means is that it is more important to see the possibilities than just learn the facts. But the fact is, sometimes Jack imagines he's Einstein. During COVID nineteen. Jack's hair started growing like crazy. He even started looking like Einstein. I love golf and tennis. Shh, don't tell anyone this, but I imagine I'm going to win the U.S. Open one day. See, the first step to achieving something big is to imagine it. But it's okay to start small. Look, this is just a piece of paper, right? Now imagine what you can do with it. Make it into a paper ball and play with friends, or make it into a paper airplane and fly far, far away. So far, I've only been to six countries: Japan. Mexico, China, South Korea, USA, and of course Canada. When the lockdown came, I decided to take my whole family to Dubai on YouTube. Our family stayed in a five-star hotel, free. Our room was on the 160th floor of the tallest building in the world. Without imagination, I would have been stuck at home, bored. Remember this game? You can learn math. Play with friends, exercise your fingers, and even learn how to fold your laundry. All because you are using your imagination. With my imagination and these beads, I like dressing up and looking pretty. Try it; you can look pretty too. Without imagination, you can't learn much. Can't have fun. Last summer, my mom said, "Jenny, let's go for a hike." I asked, "Can we take Jack too?" She said, "No, it's just you and me and the clouds." But why, mom? Why not, mom? I was so sad because I love my brother. It was so boring at first, Mom. 
just kept saying, "Look down, be careful." But then I started looking up at the clouds. I'm not kidding. The clouds were having a party. A penguin was dancing with a boy that looked just like Jack. A duck was eating a peanut butter sandwich, and Mum was just sitting at a table sipping Coca Cola. So refreshing. On the way back, I said, "Mum, that was so much fun. Can we go again with real peanut butter sandwiches?" And also take Jack. My oldest sister is Winnie. No, not Winnie the Pooh. During COVID nineteen, she flew back from New York, and she had to go into two weeks of quarantine in her dark little basement. Poor Winnie. Jack and I were so upset. We decided to use our imagination and cheer her up. We did this painting for her. Winnie loves Disneyland, so that teacup on the top left is Minnie. Me. On the top right is Mickey. Jack. He is imagining Winnie. And an Einstein haircut. Those hearts you see are for Winnie, and for Canada. Let me teach you some ways you can use your imagination. First, at least once every day, close your eyes and daydream. Paint vivid pictures in your mind. Imagine. You're a tennis star, a Disney princess, or Einstein. Whatever you do, be imaginative and think big. I think old people call it thinking outside the box. Second, be curious and creative. Keep asking. But why or why not? If you have a bad habit, change it and replace it with a good one. Instead of wasting your time checking your phone all the time, invest your time on reading books, especially fairy tales, and have face-to-face -face conversations. Did you know that Steve Jobs? Created the iPhone, but he didn't let his own kids spend much time on them. Third, be more playful, like a kid. Dance, sing, and hug for no reason. If you don't know how, hire an eight-year-old. Children have an endless imagination. And few boundaries. It takes them to the most awesome distant places, like Dubai. <laughs> Trust me. Imagination leads to big actions and important changes. Trust me. Start living in the best nation in the world. I promise. You will live a life. Beyond imagination.